we absolutely need better local control so that we can tailor our response and tailor our caution based on what's happening in our community. As the state begins to allow more businesses to reopen, Austin's interim health authority says he's going to release more information tomorrow about how the city will respond if local COVID-19 cases skyrocket. Models show we may see an increase in hospitalizations by mid to late June. KXAN's Eugene Cho spoke with University of Texas researchers who have been following the numbers closely. If you thought you were seeing more people out and about compared to April, you're right. UT professor James Scott says when stricter stay at home orders were in place, significantly fewer people went to parks. After the governor started easing restrictions, more people went back to parks, about half of normal use. He says increased interactions mean more opportunities for the virus to spread. And that's exactly what we would expect if there were a large number of cases coming down the pipe. Keep in mind that this is a disease that has a, a long silent period. There could be many days when you're infected and spreading the infection, uh, but you don't even know it yet. The researchers have also been looking at a reproduction number, how many people one patient infects. That came down to less than one in April. But after May 1st, it's going up again. Scott says that puts us in a danger zone for a potential surge. This is what happens when one case becomes two, two becomes four, four becomes eight, it becomes 16. If the transmission rate goes much higher, the researchers say our hospitals could be overwhelmed by late summer. They also looked at what would keep us under hospital capacity. One scenario involves four lockdowns between now and spring of 2021. The analogy I would draw here is that, uh, you know, the virus is like the cards were dealt and people's behavior is how we play that hand. Eugene Cho, KXAN News. We reached out to the governor's office to ask if each city or county could choose to close businesses again, depending on what happens in their communities. We have not heard back. When the city releases details about its surge response plan tomorrow, we'll be sure to let you know.